Hey everyone, Jacob Lundquist here from JLQ. Doing a little uh, disassembly of this wonderful little knife here. This is the Quiet Carry IQ. Check out that beauty. VG10 steel, got a reverse Tonto carbon fiber inlay. Oh, it's been a really fun knife. Frame lock, titanium. Really cool, but I am in dying to take this thing apart. So I think we just get right in there. Start off with, oh, sorry, T8 for the pivot. Looking for any thread lock. I don't see any in there. Release the tension of that. I honestly have no idea how this thing goes comes apart. So I'm just gonna push the pivot out. Try to. Looks like it's. Well, that's not coming out. I know I got another screw here for the clip. This is T6. Oh, that's spinning right there. I can feel it spin. A little pressure on it. I felt things loosen up. There we go. Okay, we got a like a race. We have some ceramic bearings there's a stop pin integrated into the uh in the blade very nice very cool on this side your lock bar i see is actually look how well this thing is like crazy machine but it's a little piece of steel in here with your detent ball so he's not, his lockup actually does not, um, doesn't ride against the titanium. Really cool. Little hole there. I don't know what that's all about. Here we clip. Oh, wow. Clip like wraps around. And he's actually secured on the back side, not, not through that hole. That goes through. The other side of the pivot, D-shaped. So it doesn't, doesn't spin. We have our other bearing. Our race, race washer. So nothing's, nothing's going on titanium. the action was pretty much perfection before I took it apart so I don't know much improving I'm gonna do you know on the uh, the back spacer here really just very minimal um, must be some fasteners underneath I'm not gonna take the carbon fiber off um, and there's a see this was this was spinning on me so it does look like maybe we intended to have a uh, D D it's like milled out, you know, so it doesn't spin, but it did spin on me. So it's just a little spinner there. All right, so let's clean her up and uh, get this thing all lubed up. All right, so I've got a little, some uh, cleaning cloths here, a little solution. I'm just gonna start getting any grease. Everything's pretty darn clean. Bryce uh, from Quiet Query does a heck of a job. Oh, I just noticed it's a little loose in there in the blade. Um, so. I'm just gonna leave it in there for now. Um, definitely not a press fit, which is probably a good thing. Kind of floating there a little bit. In there, I like that little little machining. Very cool. So 
hard to get the, the, the dark on the video. This doesn't quite show up as nice as I'd like, but. It's like very simple, very nice machining on everything. Everything's chamfered well. Everything has just a slight chamfer or rounding on it, contoured. Very cool. We'll just clean off the bearings a little bit. All just caged ceramic bearings. Very nice. Erase. There you go. Very cool. It's gonna dry. Got a little crazy on the solution with the blade. Careful with this guy too. This thing is sharp. Did a heck of a job. Very cool. I'm just checking everything out when I clean it. So it's all. That's the best thing about taking a knife part. You can see how it's made. Yeah, your detent, not, no ramp or anything. Nice lockup ramp. Love this swedge. Very cool. All right, I think we're ready to uh, put this guy back together. All right. So we got a little bit of uh, nano oil here, um, just a medium weight. So let's start putting things back together. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of oil underneath the races, just to help with any uh, kind of any type of uh, issue with um, rust or inhibitor, just to help with that. I don't think it matters which which side the race, you know, there's a little groove on this side that you can see. So I'm gonna leave those facing up um, for now because I know the bearings were riding on those. And we're gonna put the bearings in. Actually, I'm gonna put the bearings in the blade. A little bit of oil there. All right, this is always the fun part. Like, how am I gonna do this? Okay, so this is the show side. So this had this on it. Oh, that's, that's right. It's milled. It's gonna go in one way, which is nice. I'm gonna put on that other bearing. I don't think it matters what way the bearing goes on, but. race on. There we go, put a little bit on the pivot. Clean all around. Just set this in there like so. See how the thing, the stop pin travels inside that pocket there. Very cool. That race will stay there. We'll go kind of in an unlocked position. Oh, 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 oh. I put a little bit of oil on that detent track. It's all cleaned up here. And I gotta say that his fit and finish on these things are crazy. All right, so I'm gonna start start the pivot with the T8. It's always nice to have a couple of these ready. I'm not gonna go crazy tight. I'm just gonna get it. Oop, oop. I'm gonna get it started. There we go. Kind of holding down on the pivot side. All right, now I gotta put this in through the back. Didn't believe it. 
Sorry. I don't believe it was. We can only go in one way. There it goes. Okay. That was seeing a slight turn, but that one can only go in one way. And this is the T6. Through the clip. Come on. There it goes. Get that started. Oh, I can feel it. Yeah, feel it grab. Snug it up a bit. I'm gonna finish tightening up the pivot. There we go. Lock it up there. A little just just snug. I don't feel my centering's off just a little bit. Really close. A bit more snug. Loosen this up just a little bit. Blade play. Oh no. She's nice. A little, a little on the tight side. There we go. No blade play. Up and down, side to side. All shut. Centering is near perfection now. Action. Feels good. that oil a little bit. Can't even hear. Yeah, can't even hear the bearings now. Before I had a little bit of sound. But that's nice. I like it. Alright. One more look. Yep. There it is. That is the Quiet Carry IQ. Just came out. Go to quietcarry.com. Check this guy out. Um, I don't think you'd be disappointed in this one, guys. This thing is awesome.